What's up everyone? Welcome to Coffee Talk Tuesday. Today's going to be a very fun episode for me because I think it's one that would be very beneficial to people who are trying to start a career, start an entrepreneurial ship, adventure, journey, journey in life. I mean, this relates to anything as far as like accomplishments, goals, and that is a fear of failure. So many people are afraid to fail these days and if you think everything we do in life or one way we normally better ourselves is we learn from a past mistake, we learn from a failure. If you wanna relate this to even something in the gym, when you train at the gym, you're going most of the time for muscle failure. What happens when your muscle fails is you're breaking down those fibers in your muscle, right? They come back stronger. Next time you'll lift more, next time you'll lift more weight, more reps, more sets, higher volume. Same thing pertains to life, you're constantly Striving to do something, have a goal, you fail at that goal, you learn from your mistakes, you build up upon that, and you grow even further. You know, everyone is afraid that what people will think of me if I fail, uh, what, you know, my colleagues will say, what my peers will say. Sometimes I have goals or ambitions in my life that people are like, yeah, that's, that's not going to work, Daniel. And you know what? I kind of hope it doesn't so that I can prove them wrong when I actually make it work. You know, there's a lot of things that I have said before and people were like, it's more of just a wanting to prove people wrong for me. I love proving people wrong. I love to debate. I love to, I don't want to say I love to always be right, but I do. But if I'm wrong, fucking great. That's fantastic because I can go back and learn from that. If somebody teaches me something, that's fantastic because next time if I'm in that same encounter, like I may have failed and lost that debate or that conversation or that goal I didn't accomplish that somebody said I wouldn't accomplish, but then I can build on that and I can learn more. So I strive off of failing yet succeeding at the same time. You know, you watch a lot of these influencers and motivators and they're like, oh, like seek out failure. I don't think that's the greatest method of going about this. I wouldn't say seek out failure, but recognize when it happens that it is a good thing because you can grow from it. So right now, if you're in the middle of failing in something that you didn't want to fail at, or you're about to prove somebody right by them telling you that you failed and you're actually failing, go out and prove them wrong. Because in a couple months, I'm about to do that. And I haven't told you guys yet, so you guys can stay tuned for that one. Until next time, hopefully this video resonates with you. I want you to drop down in the comment section below, tell me something that you have failed in in life, and then how you have grown from that. And until next time, have a good one.